guys, in today's video, I am going to be unboxing this new Today's Momoko doll that I just received. So this Momoko is number 1801 and she was made for the Year of the Dog in the Chinese Zodiac. So these two little pigtails that she has on the side of her head are to imitate dog ears. Along with her, I also purchased some accessories. So we have this turtleneck sweater right here. I really love the color. Although I'm a little concerned as to how I'm supposed to put it on the doll. I don't really know if you're supposed to take off heads on Momoko bodies. I don't really know how I'm going to take off her head to fit it on her. Or maybe she has a little Velcro right here on the back of the sweater. Let's check actually. Ooh, this feels very, very soft. That's so nice. That literally feels like a sweater that I would wear myself. <laughs> so it's pretty cool. Here it is from Close Up. Very nicely made. Although there is no Velcro or buttons on the sweater whatsoever. So I don't know what we're gonna do. Along with the sweater, I purchased some boots. These are very long boots. They're very pretty and some short booties as well, both black, because I thought that it would go with everything. Here are the boots, they are so well made, I'm really impressed. They really look like there's a foot in there, and they're so detailed, it's really pretty. I really love the Momoko dolls line, just because of how realistic they look, and how realistic the shoes and all the accessories look as well. And here are some very long boots that I also purchased. There's a little belt detail right here. They're really, really pretty and very long as well. <laughs> and now I think we waited long enough to finally open this beautiful doll. Here she is. So beautiful, so lovely. As always, Momoko dolls are just precious, really. Here's a close-up from her face. Sorry for the glare. <laughs> Let's remove this, actually. And here she is. She is absolutely lovely. Look at her cute, sweet little face. Although I have noticed that she has a little bit of glossiness right here because of the plastic. I guess she was in that plastic for too long. So I'm going to see how I could remove this little glossiness on her forehead but here she is here are her little pigtails right here just stuck to the side of her face she's so sweet so she comes with these pajama this pajama set right here and today's momoko normally don't come with any clothes which is why i purchased some clothing I noticed that her head is also a little loose but that's okay she can hold her poses pretty well so it's fine Let's try on the shoes on her because I'm really I'm really curious to see. And by the way, she has joints right here that make it so she can fold her arms and her legs at a 90 degree angle. And so do her hands like this up and down. And her ankles as well up and down. Oh, actually, I just noticed she has a little nail polish on her toes. I don't know if you can see that. She also has nail polish on her hands right here. So these should simply slip on like so. Oh wow, look at that. That is absolutely wonderful. And here she is with both boots on. It honestly looks so fashionable. I really, really love it. It's so pretty. Here is what she looks like with both of the boots on. And now we can try on this outfit on her. I think it would be fun to put these long boots along with this pink sweater. Here is what the body looks like. We have a joint right here so she can rotate and she can sit as well. And here's the neck peg. Here she is all dressed up. She looks so fancy. I think she's the fanciest of all of my dolls. <laughs> Like, the fact that these look so detailed like this, I think is what makes Momoko truly special. Here's a close-up of the outfit. With these lovely, really long boots that accentuate her long legs. They have an opening right here, if you notice, so you can just slip on the, the foot. Yeah. 
and let's not forget her lovely little face. So thank you so 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 much for watching this video. Do tell me down below what you think of this Momoko 1801 version. And I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye!